So we started iGEM because the people who wanted to work with us were the 18-year-olds. iGEM thrived as biotech boomed. But Andy warned Congress America's lead in the field is slipping, while China has made synthetic biology a national priority. How concerned are you that there are not more American participants in, in iGEM? I mean, it's profound concern. It's urgent that leadership of the next generation of biotechnology has a strong presence in America and is represented by young American leaders. Andy was encouraged by the work done by the team from Georgia and wanted to know more. Like, how do you deliver it? Yeah, so right. we want to deliver it through lipid nanoparticles. Andy echoed what other scientists told us, that Lambert's project could be a major scientific breakthrough if further testing pans out. This year, they appear to have developed a better diagnostic for Lyme disease than anything I've seen before. It's not only applicable to Lyme disease, but anything you could find in your blood. 